The purpose of this vigil is to ask for forgiveness. It's part of a four-day meeting titled Towards Healing and Renewal, where bishops and heads of religious orders are discussing ways to prevent cases of sexual abuse. It began with 15 minutes of complete silence in the dark. During that time, photographs of other great tragedies that happened throughout the last century were displayed, from Auschwitz to Nagasaki. The vigil was led by Cardinal Mark Ule, who serves as the prefect of the Congregation for Bishops. The cardinal apologized to God and to the victims. Then he recognized the terrible mistakes of the bishops who ignored the victims. He then added it would never happen again. Sometimes the violence was committed by deeply disturbed persons or by those who had themselves been abused. It was necessary to take action concerning them and to prevent them from continuing any form of ministry for which they were obviously not suitable. This was not always done properly, and once again, we apologize to the victims. Afterwards, several people, including a teacher, the superior of a religious order, a priest, a relative of a victim, a pilgrim and the cardinal apologized and placed candles at the end of a cross. Minutes later, one of the victims joined in the prayer, asking God to forgive the abusers. She also asked God to help her forgive the priest who abused her and those who protected him.